Hello people. We're getting a bit of uh, bad weather once again here in the UK. It's a little bit typical, isn't it? I think that's hailstones actually. Um, so apologies if you can't hear too well, but um, we'll try and get through this together. As the title says, oh, I can sit back now. As the title says on the video, it's um, I still can't get my head around the number. 10,000 subscribers. <laughs> Man, you've got to be kidding me. 10,000. Man, that's in, in two years, in 24 months. That's crazy. There's some good channels out there who have been around a lot longer than that, who have less than that. Who, in my opinion, have far better content than that. Um, I don't know how I ended up here. The only thing I can think of that's given me a big help was being on the TV, on that um, National Geographic channel. Really, really helped. It's just gone crazy. So, hence, my videos have reached out to more and more people. Um, we're putting in more and more comments and more and more subscribers and enriching everyone's experience um, for growing their knowledge, really. So, it's been a great success and amazing. Um, <laughs> it, is, it is really hard for me to get my head around that, actually. 10,000 people, this is insane. So, I think I need to calm down. I've just come back from work and it's just been balls out, you know, hence there's not that been many videos of outdoors because it's been like 60 hour, 10 day, so uh, see I'm screwed, brain screwed. <laughs> We're doing six days a week for 10 hours a day and it's pretty much dark in the morning and dark when I get back. And it's just been raining a hell of a lot and it's been windy quite a lot recently as well. So getting outside in the dark in them conditions after doing all, all that amount of work, ah, ah, sod that. <laughs> Just haven't got the time, I feel screwed, I've got lots of other things to do. So, I'm totally shattered. Trying to have a nice cup of tea, eh? In fact, this could also be a bit of um, a tag response to Skids, Skids Bushcraft. Cup of tea outside, why not? Okay, let's get a brew on. That's it, brew done. Lovely jubbly. Can't beat a nice hot cup of tea after a bloody, a ball busting week at work, you know. Cheers. Oh 
Oh yeah. Nice one. Let's put that down. That way. Ah. Right. 10,000 subscribers. <laughs> it is insane. It, believe me, it is insane. Um, the only way I can think about it is putting 10,000 people in one huge room and look at them. <laughs> Whoa, that's freaky shit. So it's freaky to you guys, really. I'll tell you what, let's move that back there because I'm just a bit paranoid about that catching fire to that little hurricane out there. Um, yeah, back to the vid. Um, I am really lost for words, to be honest. Um, I was thinking of um, writing down something to say, like prompt notes and speeches, but no, let's, let's give up, man. Just roll with the punches. Um, yeah, big thanks to Armour Cockroach, basically, who put me on to um, the UK Preppers 2 programme. Got me on there. Hence, subs have just been running in everywhere. And a good thing about this um, community, because we all call it the community, you shouldn't call it the bushcraft community because it reaches far more than just carving spoons and things. This is a big um, community. You can't really call it anything else really. A big community. Um, I forgot what I was going to say now. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> yeah. Um, a good friend of mine who, um, who served, with, uh, served with me um, a long time ago um, when Golf 1 just started. Um, my service come to an end around that time. Um, Adrian stayed in and he carried on um, going up north, serving up there full time because we was just reserves, you know. Um, we nearly got called up to go out in the golf, which is pretty scary, really. So I'm grateful that I never got to see any bad shit. So lucky, really, considering what's been going on with the guys since you know times like that and beyond. Um, Anyway, enough of all that waffling, this is a crazy video, sorry about this, but it's a, it's a weird one, it's all unplanned. Um, my mate Adrian um, just happened to watch UK Preppers too, and saw me on there, and it done his head in, because he wasn't sure if it was me or not. So obviously he went onto YouTube, because it was promoted from the programme, and um, he asked me what unit and regiment I served in, and all the rest of it, to confirm it all, and I couldn't get back to him, because he had bloody contact lock paranoid probably so um, I've done a video explaining the contact lock on my Christmas Day video and um, he took his lock off contacted me I contacted him turns out it was him and um, I phoned a guy up yesterday when I was at work and um, yeah work today it's been 23 years since the last time we spoke and you know I only had like 15 minutes or so and I might get back to work because my balls would have been chewed off <laughs> So I will catch up with you um, when I get some time, Adrian. Things are just mental, mate. They really are. It's just balls out, freaking. The shed hasn't been done. You know, the truck had a cam belt done, so the money from that hasn't gone into the shed like I wanted to do this weekend. It's, uh, but um, that's how it is. So um, yeah, going back to it, um, the community thing. Uh, it does reunite, connect, and link people of like-mindedness. It's brilliant. It's like a dating agency for everyone, really. <laughs> but you ain't got to get down and dirty. <laughs> so, um, yeah. It means a lot, this community. It really does. And to have 10,000 people just watching my videos is just insane. And I think it was seven, 800,000 video views for 24 months is balmy. Bonkers, as Dell would say. <laughs> Total bonkers, mate. So, um... At least I can do is to um, mark this monumental number by a little giveaway. Um, I was going to do what um, a friend of mine done was um, just do a giveaway, just call it nothing special, just me, I don't know, walking in the woods or something. And then not many people will watch it, but your core cool fans will. And they're the ones that you want to, um, the interaction and the interest, you know, perpetuates from there. So he done that and I thought, yeah, it's a great idea. Um, I could have done that, but I'll tell you what we'll do, um, the competition I've done recently, my little go bag, which, which um, I think um, well, Sly won, Why right, Sly, um, what happened was, I opened it to everyone, and all you had to do was, I'm in, and when I'd done that, I had 850 plus entries, and when I went through, it took a long time, it took a long time, to go through those entries, and look at the channels who I don't know, as my friends and subs 
and looked at their channels. And do you know what pissed me off? It really dumb way then actually, and that is why I'm doing a VR only competition. So these you guys who just want to do I'm in, sorry, but I'll explain why. Um, some of the guys, as I said, I didn't know who their channels were and who they were. All they do is they just go around entering competitions. They couldn't give a monkey's fart about this community. Um, so I've got no time for people like that. I want to support this community with our thing. It's not open to people who just want to do competitions and that's it. That's just crap. I'm not having that. So the VR, the video response, um, which I want you to do, to win prize one. Now, you're gonna love this, the top prize is this little baby here. Some of you will know what it is already. It's the uh, Chris Kane survival knife. Brand new, never been used. I've sharpened it. It didn't need much sharpening, if I'm honest. Um, that is insanely sharp, you can shave Anything you want with that. I'm not sure if it's picking up because of the background focus and everything. But yeah, it's a top blade. Um, Dave Canterbury on the Pathfinder School sells them on his website. And believe you me, I think we know Dave now. He does tend to know what he's talking about. So for him to have this and he endorses it, can't be a bad thing. So that is first prize. So if your name gets pulled out of the VR hat, you win that. Anywhere in the world, not fast. As not just UK only, it's anywhere in the world. And it seems only fair to do a runner-up prize. Now, some of you guys, let's see where it is, will know about this knife, which I carry all the time. It is such a, a beautiful tool to have in a hand. It really is. Um, I had to touch it up a few times every day because I was cutting through literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of strands of waxed, tough paracord. And it, it dulled the edge. Um, a little bit of a sharpen and it was, well, it's in, it's very, very sharp indeed. That's the 511 CS2 spear point. And um, I gave one of these to Dell, Dirty Room Knives, and he just uses it now and again. There's no doubt the guy's got many blades. So, that's one I'll carry, but I'm going to give away a brand new one, I'm still in this box. So you're going to get a brand new one of those um, for second place. Right, so, says he, what you have to do um, is a VR, and the VR is, all you have to do is do a video explaining in any way you want what this special community means to you what it means to you, what it's done for you, how you've benefited from it. That's it. Just do a video. It can go on for one minute, it can go on for an hour. It doesn't matter. Just uh, do a video and we'll see. And I think Google, Google+, Plus, YouTube, it's all been crap um, a little while ago regarding VR's video responses. And I've figured out a way around this and I haven't as yet seen anyone else do this. This could be a first. I might be wrong. Um, when you do your VR, your video response, send me a PM with the link of your VR. I will watch that link and if it's acceptable, I'm going to put it in a description box. So this video, underneath is the description box and one by one I'm going to add all of your entries into the description box with your channel name next to each link. So someone will watch this video, they want to see the other entries, just go to the description box See all the, the channel's entries and the links. Click on the video and you can watch their video. That's the only way around I can think of this VR thing which they just took away from us. Which is a bag of bullshit really because they've all been deleted, it's all been crap. And here comes the rain. <laughs> Bloody typical, isn't it? All right, the best thing to do when it starts to rain, have a nice hot cup of tea. Oh wow, still got a tea bag in there because you know me by now. Love a good strong cup of tea. None of that milky gnats piss. Not in this shed. Not in this body. <laughs> so that's what it is guys. Um, once again I really am humbled by all your support, your friendship, 
loyalty as well. I think, and that's a, a rare word to use these days, loyalty. There's a lot of guys out there who've, who've got my back. And likewise, I've got a lot of people's backs out there too. Because they do get the old prat who leaves silly comments, which aren't helpful, aren't constructive. And in my eyes, I just remove them. I just can't be bothered to gain, to step into an argument or a debate with them. I haven't got the time. And straight away I can see if it's negative or it's, it's going to wind someone up in some way. I just go, bing, remove them. Simple as that. And if they carry on, I'll just ban them from my channel. Coincidentally, I think there's an imposter as well. There's another funky prepper, spelled differently, of a space with an E before the Y. And he's got a little picture of Benny Hill. I've got a feeling this guy could be a bit of a prick, if I'm honest, due to um, a couple of comments that he has left. So um, I'm going to watch watch out for this guy. And if I see him keep popping up and leaving comments, I don't want him giving my channel a bad name. So if it appears to be the case and you do see that channel, he might have changed the link on there, but it's going to be that name. Fun key prepper with a space in between. Um, just report him, because the more people report him, he's just going to get bumped off. Because, as I said, we've got a good thing going here, and everything in this channel is non bullshit. It's all straight. And the last thing I want is some idiot imposter, a troll, whatever you want to call them, coming along and leaving comments on other people's videos, and they might misinterpret that it's me. So, yeah, I've got 10,000 people behind me, so if you're that guy watching this, Good luck if you want to carry on being a prick, that's all I can say. <laughs> so, thanks for watching guys. I really do appreciate all your comments. I, bloody hell. I don't reply to all of them for obvious reasons, because there's just so many. But I do read them all. And um, YouTube has done a comment section now, which I can check up on, which is pretty cool. So, that's it. Good luck to everyone who wants to enter the competition. And this is my entry for Skids Bushcraft, for the a brew outside. I might as well be outside. Five feet away, I'm away from an 80 mile an hour gusty storm. Which is nice. <laughs> so, that's it. Means the world to me, it really does. You guys, you're the best. You really are. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay funky.